What is going on everybody? It is D here from Shark Bite Collects. Today's video I'm going to talk about two things. I'm going to talk about the new GameStop exclusive Pokemon card that's coming out. And at the end of the video, I'm going to talk about a giveaway that I'm doing. But to start this off, I'm going to talk about the new GameStop card. So if you already know, about a month ago, GameStop released a specific card called the Flapple. I mean, it's normal Pokemon, but Flapple, I'm going to put it up on screen. And it is a uh, hollow, as you can tell. And it has the little GameStop symbol on the bottom. It just says GameStop. But it was exclusive to GameStop only. And the way you got it is by spending $15 on Pokemon products in store. So, like, you could not go get a video game and then spend 15 bucks on that and then get the card. It had to be po anything Pokemon. But that rule didn't really apply, I'm going to say, because I had one GameStop go up there. I didn't buy anything Pokemon, but I just asked for it. I was like, can I still get this card? And they, you know, they were like, whatever. But I also had another GameStop I go to, and she said that I could only get the card if I spent 15 on Pokemon cards, which wasn't even the rule. It was just Pokemon in general, but depends on your GameStop. Hopefully, you have a nice GameStop. I have a nice GameStop. And honestly, they actually gave me like two just for free. So, you know, anyways, yes, you got to spend 15 bucks to get it. But then people were going on eBay and reselling it, right? For like day one, 30 bucks or something like that. 30, you know, 25, 30. But it only cost $15, which means you go to GameStop, you buy yourself a little Charizard um, plush, you get the card, you go home, put the card up for 30 bucks, you sell it, you just got your Charizard plush for free, and you made 15 bucks. So people were going around getting as much as they can and doing it. I mean, I was doing that too, because it's free Pokemon products. Like, as you can tell, you can get these plushes that I have, they're free. Like, 30, 30 bucks, but again, it is a hollow. And if you guys know, there's swirls. If you know what a swirl is, it's on your hollow card. No, just a little swirl blows up the price of the card. You probably already know about that, but if your Flapple had a swirl on it, it could be a super small swirl too. Just a noticeable swirl. You were getting anywhere from 90 to 100 bucks on this card. That you only spent $15 for, right? But that's enough on the Flapple. I just wanted to give you some background on that. I'm talking about the new one that's coming out. So on June 18th, in GameStop, which is the release date of Chilling Rain, like the official release date, GameStop is doing another card like that. It's going to be the Santa Conda. And no one really knows the artwork yet. People are saying it's going to be the Battle Styles artwork. But again, whatever it is, it will be Santa Conda, it will be Hollow, and you will be looking for those swirls on your card. Because I promise you, if you get a swirl, your card's going to skyrocket. But just like the last one, it's going to be $15 on Pokemon products. Then again, it really depends on your GameStop and if they, they're cool or not. So hopefully you have a good GameStop and they just give you some. And resale, I don't think resale will be as crazy as it was on the Flapple. Because like, then people realized, wait, I can just go get this myself for free. But, I mean, you can still try. I bet day one, you know, you'll probably make your money back in a little bit more. But as time goes on, it's going to drop super quick. But if you get the swirl, the price won't drop. You always have a high Pokemon card. So that's going to be something to look out for. So which means if you're GameStop, if you go to GameStop and you buy ETB, that's 50 bucks, 15, 30, 45. That's three cards right there for just one ETB. So if you're selling your card for like 30 bucks day one, you could almost make your money back on the ETB. Again, unless your GameStop limits you to one, which I don't know if they will. But I don't think mine will, but, you know, take advantage of this card, bro, because you can go out there and get stuff for free. I recommend you keep some, because it is exclusive, like the Flapple. I have a couple left. They're never going to come out again with the GameStop. So I recommend you keep some. Look for that swirl, bro, because you want that swirl on your card. You know, just... Have fun going around trying to get yourself some Tanacondas out here. Hopefully they don't limit, but who knows. 
anyways, the second thing I want to talk about is a giveaway that I'm doing. I have, I am at 98 subscribers. When I get to 100, so two away, I will be giving away two Shining Fates Pokemon mini tins. Actually, let me grab them for you, real quick. I will be giving these away, Shining Fates mini tins. They have. A booster pack that contains 10 cards and one basic energy. Oh, they have two Shining Fates booster packs, a coin, and a Pokemon art card shown the form on this mini tin. So I have a Mamphy and I have a Celebi. So you will get two packs and that special promo Celebi or Mamphy, whichever one you get. I'll be doing them separately, so like not one person gets both. But all, all I gotta do is subscribe because I gotta get to 100 for me to give them away. Leave a like, and then comment anything on this video, literally anything, and hopefully if I hit 100, I'll put everyone that comments into a random number, and then I'll do that live so you can see that I'm not just picking whoever I want. And I will be giving those away to two subscribers. But remember, only if I hit 100, so two people if you're watching, you want a free little 10, all you gotta do is comment and like, you can do that. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Make sure June 18th, go out there and get yourself from SantaCon the GameStop exclusives. Because like I said, you can go out there and get yourself some free Pokemon items. There's no reason not to go out and do it. And again, look for that swirl. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching.